Hi, I'm Sue with Woman of Noble Character. Colors are used throughout the Bible to reflect meaning or spiritual truths. They have symbolic significance and can remind us of God and his plan for salvation. When we look at symbolism as part of the Bible, um, it's important to look at the bigger picture. And by studying colors, we're looking at a form of nonverbal communication by God. He uses colors as a visual sign to represent his promises, his plan for our salvation, and much more. We know that God, and even Jesus on his time on earth, has used Bible symbolism frequently um, to illustrate biblical truths. For example, we know that Jesus was described as the sacrificial lamb, and Satan often symbolized by a serpent. Uh, but in other ways, we can look at colors and draw deep meaning and symbolism from them. God may speak to you through symbolism as well. Colors in the Bible have deep symbolism, but many colors do have multiple meanings. Blue, for example. Blue, according to many biblical scholars, represents heaven. It's the color of the sky and a reminder of the heavenly realm. But it's also used... Um, in, in other ways in the Bible. It is used over 50 times in the Old Testament. So its use in scripture lends itself symbolically to things that represent God. Um, in this post, we share lots and lots of scripture about blue as being used in connection with riches and sapphires. Uh, the rich could adorn their sails or banners with fine, embro fine embroidery, and blue was an expensive color to use. Uh, it's also associated with physical punishment, most precisely the bru uh, blueness caused by bruising. Um, I also share a bit about use of dyeing with the color blue and how difficult it was, but we talk about other colors related to blue, such as sapphire, turquoise, and... Um, and other shades of blue. And I've included additional videos for you about the use of color blue by Pastor Jim Stanley. So I hope you'll enjoy the post. I'd love to hear your feedback. And if blue has brought any specific meaning to you while reading scripture. So have a beautiful and blessed day and thanks for stopping by.